poor road infrastructure continues to be a sore sight in the northwest. It's painful that um, for more than five years, ten years, our roads have been like this. I was suggesting that they use a pavement instead of the tar roads because the buses and the, the chrome trucks, they're using the same tar road. So it's not lasting because of, I think, the weight or whatever of the trucks. Local government representatives are pleading for help. If I invite you tomorrow, will you come and assist me with that po those potholes? The pothole challenges in this country that this country faces is not only a headache for road users but also us as government. They want the provincial and municipal roads to be of the same quality as those in the neighboring provinces. The road condition uh, on the N14, particularly as you take off from Fentersop to Houting, is not impressive at all. On the very same road, con uh, on the very same road. As you get into Houghton, you start to experience a smooth driving. When you travel with your eyes closed, and you travel from Limpo, and you enter the northwest from the side of Wombath, with your eyes closed, you don't have to open your eyes. The car will tell you that you are now getting into the northwest. Law enforcement agencies are equally inconvenienced. I'm spending millions in terms of both the provincial government is here, in terms of servicing and repairing uh, police vehicles, damaged by potholes and all these things. I am unable to provide rapid response services because of the poor quality of roads. Sandra has now committed to help. In the next three to five years, we think or we are planning to spend up to 12 billion rand in the northwest. And this is going to be distributed to some extent around all the district municipalities. For example, we've got planned roads on the planned upgrades on the N12, the R52, the N14, uh, to name but a few. There are also other roads that are currently in construction, like the R504 and a couple of other roads around the, the northwest. Although plans still need to be finalized to roll out better road infrastructure, Motorists hope that they will soon be able to use roads that have been improved. Itumelen Kajane, SABC News, Marikana.